pues mira mami. Aquí asustado, pero mira la. May God be with you all. A ella le gusta gozar a vacilar, yeah. Con unos traguitos de Fernet. Cata ya, perrea en la disco como nadie más. Ella es mi gata, yeah. Ella es mi gata, ya, ya. Ella es mi gata, ya. Perrea en la disco como nadie más. Ella es mi gata, yeah. Ella es mi gata, ya, 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 ya. En fiesta. What's up guys, welcome back to another video, welcome back to another adventure with Be Easy Man. I'm sitting in my studio right now, but this video is super interesting, and again, I've been doing these adventures for years. I just started recording it too late. Anyways, this is us in Aruba. Yo, what's up, we're about to do a, we're about to do a nice Caribbean, uh, what is it, snorkeling? In that video, how dark I was, I was getting beat by the sun. But my mom and my, my sister went with me, my son and my daughter. Um, it was fun, it was great having them there. It was the first time bringing my mom on vacation with me in Aruba. So we're about to board the uh, Speedy Gonzalez and we're gonna show you guys what we're about to do. We can go snorkeling, we can jump off the road, we can drink, eat, all of the above. Um, we pay $60 per person, which is actually great. So again, it's gonna be super lit. on this right now. I mean, I, I'm gonna give you guys an example. You gotta, Let's go. Look, look at the boy that's coming to pick us up. You see how adorable my son was? <laughs> Looks like his dad. Yo, so we're on the boat right now, my mom. With their parents. It's not easy, it's not easy convincing them to do these excursions. And it's definitely not easy to get them on the boat. Trying to convince them, I literally had to tell my mom like, Everything is already paid for, it's too late, we have to go. It's like, it's mandatory, you have to show up. We got other people that's also doing the, the adventure, the extravagant adventure. Yet windy, but very clear. I enjoy that island. The scenery in this, you know, by the water, it was beautiful. Um, where did I stay? I believe I stood over at the Courtyard Marriott, or the Courtyard in in Aruba, right on the strip. Either way, you were allowed to visit all hotels. It doesn't matter whether you you were a part of the hotel or not. You were allowed to go in there and actually visit and enjoy the amenities. Too bad we did not get to go to the all-inclusive, all-adult one. <laughs> believe my son was probably four years old at that age maybe three if I'm not mistaken I think he's probably three years old so I'll tell you a funny story about that for the record let me show you what I was recording with obviously not 
the new kind of phone. But I was literally recording like this. This that's basically the only camera that I owned at that time, maybe a GoPro, but for the most part, it was just like this, all right? Come over here, just record. And obviously my sister was holding the camera, which she sucks at it. This is the haters. She didn't want to hold the camera for too long. But at this point in time, I was looking at the Titanic, Leonardo DiCaprio. You know, spreading these wings. At least I try. We had the opportunity and the blessing to actually go down where there's a sunken ship, where they've never retrieved it. I believe this sunk maybe over 100 years ago. I do not recall what was the name of it, but we got an opportunity to drive right over it. And guess what happened? We got to snorkel and actually see the, the ship. Now, I'm gonna say it wasn't as easy as what I, it would have been if I was sober. <laughs> I thought I was bold, not wearing a life a life jacket in the water in the sea, and I can say the amount of salt water that I swallowed. So on this catamaran, they had a little slide. Once you climb up to the top, you can come all the way down and slide into the water. And also, they had a little string where you could just string off the boat. <clears throat> After a couple of drinks, it's probably the best idea. But after? I don't know. My sister has a good story about that, but we'll talk about that. To go down belly first, which it seemed like a good idea at the moment, at the time. And then taking those turns, belly first. All right, now I would say this is the part of the trip, as I said before, you swing off the little swing and into the water. By the way, this is the first time I actually go. I actually owned the GoPro Hero 4. I thought I was a filmmaker in the makings when I owned that camera. And I needed to learn some fundamentals on it. But either way, I still recorded a couple of things. But this was the trip to Aruba that I did not vlog. Or I still recorded it, but I never put it out there to the world. I was so brave back then. I don't know what happened. If she got older, she just got. So 
So we're out and about today. We're out here about to drive the ATVs. Yes, I am recording with my phone because my beautiful daughter left my camera at, her, at our friend's house. So right now, we're doing a tour with all zoo animals, snakes, all of the above. And we're gonna be riding the ATVs. So I'll definitely be recording that so you guys can take a look at that. So look at some of these animals. I was probably 10 shots deep by the time I began swinging into the ocean. 10 shots deep. The night ended crazy. I can say I had a great time, but I missed an event because I couldn't make it to the event. And mind you, my mom has never ever seen me under these type of conditions ever. But embarrassing for sure. It's vacation. It's what we're supposed to do. What else are you supposed to do? Anyways, so we decided the following day we're going to go out, uh, you know, go-kart riding or, sorry, uh, trail riding on the four-wheelers. We decided to go on there, record it again, grab my phone, record it for dear sake, you know. Maybe it wasn't the best quality of video, but I anything that I was able to work with, I could shoot on this camera. That's what it was possible. So. Yeah, so we're over here on ATV.